Oh my, you know what? We should totally take a picture together, okay? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, here we go. Okay, smile. Let's see. No, you you look great. Could you just like like tone it down just a little bit? You're making me look like a wet rat next to you. Okay, yeah, let's just take another one. Okay, here we go. Cheese. <laughs> All right, here, let's see. You know what? Just gonna crop me out. I think that's good. It's fine. No, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel or welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Call Me Chris. You can call me Chris and stop being so photogenic. You little saucy, saucy bean. You're making me look bad. But seriously, when I take photos with you guys out in like public and then you tag me in them on Instagram, I always look so bad. But you guys look great. So I'll keep taking them. But, but today, today, we are getting put to the test. We need to spot the straight out of the gaze. <laughs> And I'm excited because I got a, a great gaydar because I'm part of that squad, you know? Might not be on the male squad, but I feel I'm in there. I'm in the, I'm in that spectrum of gay. So I feel like I could feel them out. Not feel them. I'm not going to feel it. <laughs> Ah, uh, Jubilee's always pumping out these weird videos and I'm here for it. So play along and let's go spot the straight. Here we go. <laughs> And also a little announcement that uh, unfortunately Bill C-11 got passed in uh, Canada. So that means this could really be heavily affecting me as a Canadian creator. Um, we're going to be censored to certain degrees. So I might be not showing up on your feed as much. So just make sure to press subscribe and the little notification bell so I don't disappear on you. <laughs> So sorry. My beverage of choice was a qua qua cola, and I might burp during this. But rate my burps out of ten. Jay, how was that one? Definitely seen you do better. I'm gay. I'm gay. I'm gay. I'm gay. I'm gay. I'm gay. <laughs> yes, let's do this. Even if you're not gay, that's all right. Everybody's welcome. Play alone. To start off, I don't know who is not gay. Round um, one. Probably. Okay, like, when did we know we were school, gay? After my first relationship, uh, it was end a girl, of high school, and it was just <laughs> not for me. Um, I think for me, it was a little end late. Of school. That's all right. Like Wait, sorry, I got another names. Clay. I don't know about Clay. Clay is on my list of maybe straight so far. It was Ricky. End of school. It was like before puberty. So I was just kind of figuring top. things out for myself, and also okay. other kids were understanding too. So that really helped me to find myself when I would talk. Okay. Believable, and he's like working that crop top. So if he's straight, I give him full points. But right now, I think Ricky's gay. Fifteen, Lucifer. Oh, so I know exactly when it was. <laughs> that was the age. Grew up in a very religious home. He grew up in a religious home, and his name is Lucifer. And for those of you who don't know, Lucifer is the devil. El Diablo down here. This is where Lucifer lives. <laughs> So his parents were just, they started him off rough. <laughs> he looks like a Lucifer. He's got the red sunglasses, the red jacket. I love it. I knew when I was eight, um, my grandma eight? took him to see Matt. Mamma Mia. And if you've seen the movie, you know, <laughs> oh, the Mamma Mia. Scene, you know exactly <gasps> what I'm talking about. Oh, I knew I was gay because of that. Amanda Seyfried, when she's crawling on the beach in Mamma Mia, Jay input that right now. That scene, I was like, <laughs> I am confused. That and also um, Kira Knightley from the first Pirates of the Caribbean. She was so attractive. And then so was Johnny Depp. And then so was Orlando Bloom. And I was just in this weird trio of like, I don't know which one I like better. I can't choose it. Oh, I don't have to choose. I don't have to choose. Oh, that's fun. Didn't figure that out till much, much later in life. <laughs> was just a little bit off about me when I realized that I was more attracted to Sky than I was Sophie. I'm like, mm -hmm. something about- Okay, Matt, that was very specific. You're gay for now. Right after Twilight came out. <sighs> Ooh, Twilight, yes. Yo, who's team? Edward, who's team? yes. Okay. Of course. Tyler, of course, yes. Um, Pattinson, for mm -hmm. sure. Um, Edward. Tyler, you're looking a little straight. I don't know why, but you're looking a little straight. You're looking like there's no lefts or rights on your road, if you know what I'm saying. I don't know yet, though. I like your tie, though. That's Justin. But I called myself bisexual, and then freshman Fair. year in high school, I was just like, I'm gay. Like, the way I feel about women freshman? is nothing, cool. nothing like the way I feel about men. He's trying to convince himself. I'm a little sus of number one, whose names I already forgot, and the last two, we shall see. What okay, celebrity crushes. Celebrity crush. <gasps> Mine? Okay. I think I already just said them. Johnny Depp and Kira Knightley and Orlando Bloom and Henry Cavill and Charlize Theron, Idris Elba, Jamie Foxx. I love how these are all people that are like 20 years older than me, but it doesn't matter. That's besides the point. Anyway, it's not because I have mommy and daddy issues. Maybe it is. 
Yes. We're not going to talk about it, though. Who's your guys' celebrity crush? Let me know down below. Paul Ooh. Wesley from okay. Vampire Diaries. Oh, he like my he's attractive. Yeah. I've never really? watched the show, yeah. though. Ross Lynch. Lynch. Something about that man. Ross just... Lynch. Ooh. All right. Actually, you know what? I've seen some recent footage of him oh, singing on stage wow. shirtless and <laughs> proof. Prince and Idris Elba. Yes, this of her. And Idris Elba is a sexy man. He's like a man written by a woman. You know what I'm saying? Which is best of both worlds. Pedro Pascal. <gasps> How dare you not say it like Pedro Pascal. Pedro Pascal is also a man written by a woman. That man can have my babies that I'm not going to have. You know what I mean? And that's a lot coming from me. You can have my metaphorical babies. I will be Mrs. Bashka. You guys hate about straight men. Ooh. Let me start. Um, what do I hate about straight men? Um, it's more of what do I not not like about straight men? Wait, what do I like about straight men? That's the hard question. No, she <laughs> I'm just I'm kidding. kidding. You know, in my experience, it's mostly that they cannot emote their feelings properly. I think men in general think that they cannot emote or be vulnerable. I think they struggle with that. And I think men in the gay community, whom I have lots of friends in, have uh, more of an easier time emoting feelings. So straight men out there, don't be afraid to emote feelings. Women like that. We like when you say, hey, I'm upset, but let's sit down and talk about it. In a calm matter as well. Very important. But I don't know why I'm British. Also, just be British because that's just like takes you up a couple of notches. <laughs> Men, don't be afraid to emote your feelings. We appreciate it as women. You know, I feel like Jay is also a man written by a woman in the best way. Jay, thumbs up to you, buddy. You're a good one like take criticism oh or take God, no as yes. an answer. Yeah. Their inability to have any sort of fashion, it's just <laughs> t-shirts. Oh, fashion? Just That's kind of true. <laughs> God damn. God damn. Did she the fire come out of that one? That was still weak. I kind of threw up in my mouth. I'm not going to lie. I am a straight man right now. But <laughs> Most of the men that I have, you know, been in some sort of relationship with. You know what? No, I'm not even going to say that. You know what? Besides one of them, which they'll know who they are, they dress pretty well. Better than me. Look at how I'm dressed right now. You think I can say anything? Look at me. I look like a 12-year-old skater boy. And my hair? Pete, shut up. I'm not doing this today. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my god, I am a 12-year-old boy. Oh, well. People clearly use, like, the three-in-one shampoos, and I'm just like... Oh, oh, oh the three-in-one shampoos, yeah. yeah. Guys, yes. guys, guys, that's so true. Just... <sighs> Guys, please, for the love of dear God, use a separate shampoo, conditioner, and body wash, okay, for me. Please. Lucifer, I just wanted to ask you, um, so you said at 15 is when you knew, right? Oh, he's getting interrogated? Yes, that's when I came to terms uh -oh. with myself. And then you said, I co like, during COVID was when you told your brother? Yes. So that whole oh. time he didn't know? No. Really? How, how oh. did that feel for you? <laughs> he's like, how? <laughs> Did he not know, bitch? <laughs> He's like walking up with red sunglasses and like a thousand dollar leather jacket like, I'm gay. And his brother's like, yeah, all right. <laughs> Oh, that's so funny. That's like one of my friends that came out to me. He was gay. And he was very, very just always gay. We all knew. But he had to figure it out himself, which was fine. But then when he came out, we we're all just like, what? No, why? You're gay? Well, this is a shock to me. Gonna take me a minute. All right, I've I've had a minute. All right, let's go f drink and get some. F really didn't make a big deal. Ricky out of it. is interrogating. Really Maybe he's deflecting. Oh. <gasps> Maybe he is straight. The gay men will now vote for who they think is straight. Let's see who they think is straight. I can't see. I can't. Lucifer, that, that Ricky. Tank top that he's wearing is is really tacky. <gasps> Not the tacky tank top. The tea has been spilled. The fire has been thrown. The shade has been shaded. But that's what I was saying, Lucifer. I think he's overcompensating for the tank top. We shall see. I personally think it's Tyler in the pink with the tie. Oh. Good luck, guys. Um, no, I think it, he's gay. Kind of hurted a little bit. Justin. Kind of hurted. I think he's gay. Mainly because I'm I think he was nervous. Jeans and a t-shirt, but I look stylish and I look amazing. Yeah, you do. I love your hair. It's gorgeous. I can tell that you use a separate conditioner from your shampoo. I get that. I get that. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And my boyfriend every time I or my ex boyfriend. Oh no. Yeah. Every time I'd come oh. in, like, the room was just super messy. Why do I think Ricky is just really smart and he's just like he's giving it like he should be really convincing, but for some reason he's not. And he said my boyfriend. Oh my ex boyfriend. Meanwhile, he's got like the hottest girlfriend ever. Ricky, I am so sus of you. 
think you're adorable, but I am sus. Yeah, I'm a very active person, whether that be like going out hiking, I go out working. Matt is dressed the most straight, in my opinion, but I don't know. These are the brand new model. They have little Yeah, I know. I saw those. Oh, I saw so those. Cool. Did you oh, they know style. Yes. yes. Yeah, I did. You know, I, I am so confused. I'm in a glass case of emotion. <laughs> Like shorter men. Okay, right. submissive. Um, okay. I hate the bottom. We go on top. I guess because I was in such a controlled environment for so mm. many years. Lucifer's getting too deep with it. Say bottom. Oh, yep. Or verse. Top verse. I, I say I'm a, I'm a verse top. Top yeah. verse. Verse bottom. He's verse. definitely a bottom. Ricky is a bottom for sure. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> this is why I love it. I love hanging out with my gay friend. If you need an honest opinion, get yourself a gay friend, all right? They're not gonna sugarcoat shit. They're gonna tell you the shit, all right? I don't know if that's a whole thing, but... Like, if I went out and I was like, hey guys, yeah, I'm ready to go, like how I'm dressing right now, they'd be like this. Honey. And I'd be like, okay, I'm, I'll, I'll go check. It's okay, they're keeping me fresh. But seriously, shout out to all my gay friends. I love you guys. Nice. Or whoever the straight so is nice. dead. Ooh. Yeah, that's rough. When Matt dapped up Lucifer. That that was I was like, okay, that was Yes, little, that's that very straight. straight. That felt very Oh my god, the drama when is it dude they're all like <gasps> I would never <laughs> You know what? Actually, it's true. It's usually like hugs. Yeah, that's bad. And he's also the straightest. Uh, he wasn't on my radar. So when I started to realize he has the most straight outfit, he's looking pretty sauce. So I will put him on the list. There, and you're open to threesomes. This offer is available. Listen, I don't think I'm the one you're looking for. These aren't the droids you're looking for. But I could be. I'm just kidding. <laughs> In the master, I'm fully abstinent. You gonna take that dip? Because it's just like, it's just another person. It, it just gets a lot. I don't it know. Is. I just feel like, I, I right? completely agree. True. It's more of a novelty. True. Sure. Is it yes, like a lot yes. of I mean, no. <laughs> Mom, I'm kidding. I'm the kidding. The has been spilled. The fire has been thrown. Don't look at me like that. Ooh, Dumb smash your pass. Smash. Yeah. smash. I don't know who totally that is. Ha. Ah. No, no smash. Three. Not my type. Mm, like the rock. Smash. Oh. <gasps> smash. The rock. You like being in control, dude? The rock? Yeah. Okay. I can take okay. him. He might be a He could take the rock. He's got the power of the devil on his side. <laughs> The gay men will now vote for who they think is straight. Okay, I change my thing. I think it's Matt because of the dab up. You blew it! You f***ed up, Matt. You blew it! Ain't nobody talking. Top in the rock. Come on. Uh, uh, rock's ugly. The rock's ugly, Ricky. Oh. Good luck, gentlemen. Oh my gosh, he's so gay. There's no way. Oh, he's so gay. They're jealous. Yeah. They see I'm totally star power. Yes. They just didn't want to share the money with me. Yeah, 100%. Bitch, that offended me. Bitch, let's talk about it. Let's go for drinks. Call me up, Lucifer. Ooh, you they can, can choose not right, to continue. Use your hand on three, all right? One, oh. two, three. Do they want to continue? Wait, you just continue playing? Yeah, so you four are confident that the mole is out. Is that correct? Oh, we don't know. Uh-uh. One of them so straight. The game has ended. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Uh -uh. turns green, you have correctly voted the mole out. Uh -uh. The mole will share a cash prize. It's gonna be red because pink shirt. Taylor's not gay. I gotta be right. Why am I so anxious? Oh, okay. If I'm wrong, I will let P Pete punch me. But if I'm right, I will punch Pete. Who is it? On the count of Tyler, three, or is it the guy in the front? Step it could be Clay. One, Clay was very quiet. Oh my God! Two, Why am I so anxious? Three. Tyler? <laughs> what? Oh, yeah. Yeah. What? We're all the most. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, what? Let's go. I think there was a mix up, you guys. <laughs> Look at us. We are besties Bro. after all. Hey. I was very We're confused. All the Wait, what? Yeah. You had me with the fit, Ricky. For real? Honestly, yes. Dude, Dude, everybody is a mole. That would be so funny. <gasps> you mother. That's I not fair. Dude, I, I took a step and I was like, are these people stupid? Like, why is everyone else stepping oh, up? Oh, like, what a. Sees Tyler straight. <laughs> okay, well, if you guys need a friend, um, and you need somebody to bully and to tell that they wear terrible clothes, here, I'm right here. Well, I don't know if that means I punch Pete or Pete, 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 Pete punches me. We'll do one for one. So I think the best way to go about this, bud, is uh, maybe if I throw you up, you could just body slam me. Make it good for the camera. This is the one and only time I'm letting this happen. All right. 
After all these videos, Pete got revenge. Chris's knockout was so insanely brutal, we had to cut it out so we could only reveal the final moment. All right, my turn, bitch. Okay, everybody, I hope you enjoyed the video. Sorry it was a little anticlimactic. Hopefully me fighting Pete at the end made up for that. Um, <laughs> but I hope you liked the video. If you did, please like the video. It really, really helps out the channel. But anyway, and also, yeah, subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, this is obviously the best YouTube channel ever, mostly. And yeah, I will see y'all beautiful face in the next video, okay? Bye.